Welcome back students to Sharma Gurukula once again. Uh, today in this class let us learn regarding letter writing. So I have written here a formal letter that is a leave letter. So let us see what are all the parts in letter writing. The first part is from address. You should write the from address. Always keep it in your mind uh, my dear students that is you should always leave the left margin first point. Second point the entire thing should come in the left margin. Okay. Is it clear? See, starting from first point is, for example, Sharma, XYZ College, Thumkur. This is the from address. Again, the second step is date. You should write the date that is as 3 November 2022. For example, I have taken. Okay, next is two address for whom you are writing the class teacher or the principal or the headmaster, headmistress. Okay. The principal XYZ College Thumkur. In this XYZ College, you can fill your uh, college where you are studying. Okay. Next is salutation that is respected sir. Whether it is a principal is sir, you can write sir. Otherwise, sir or madam. Okay. Now the subject comes. Always keep it in your mind uh, the short form that is RS method. See here. First it is respected. After it is subject. This is called RS method. Always keep it in your mind, my dear students. First, you should write respected sir. After that only, you should write the subject. Even though the subject, you should write sub. That's all. Short form, you should write. Don't write subject, full form. Okay, subject is requesting for one day leave. Suppose if you want one day, you can write one day. Or two days, you can write two or three. How many days you want? You can write. One day leave as I am suffering from fever. You should uh, mention the suitable subject here that is suffering from fever fever and cold or you can write suffering from headache or you can write suffering from stomach ache or stomach pain okay now oh, right okay now the body of the letter with the reference to the above mentioned subject that is requesting for one day leave as i'm suffering from fever subject i request your good self to give me or to give permission for one day leave so you should mention the date, uh, which day you are taking the leave. One day leave on 4th of November 2022. So lastly, you should end the letter by saying thank you. Never write thanking you. Th there is no thanking you here, here. So thank you. After that, you are a student writing for the principal or writing for the class teacher. Therefore, yours obediently or you can write yours obedient student. Both are correct. Yours obediently. Always keep it in your mind the spelling of obediently or obedient. Last your signature. So this is the format of writing formal leave letter. Thank you students. Keep watching my videos.